What's up guys? This is Unrep Gaming Hardcore and it's time again for our monthly videos and we saw another November pass by and I swear time passes a little bit faster now compared to when I was a kid yeah I heard that we perceive time faster as we grow older and every single day passes by and time is always not enough and that feeling that you just woke up but in reality 12 hours passed already and I need to sleep yeah that feeling well anyways you guys enough of my rambling let's start this these are the games I played on November 2018 let's do this Okay, let's start with Destiny 2. And I got this game for free. They gave it away. So I got my shot of playing this. And I must say, this is good. You know, the feel of the guns and the graphics of the game and how they designed it and all the details of the different places. It's impressive. It's just a shame that the gaming community hated this game because of greed. I don't want to elaborate. Long story short, people hated this game because of how all the things <laughs> just watch some videos about it and you will know so I'm playing this game for like an hour or more a day and I plan to play this game until I get to the end game and see how they are going to entice me to use my money in this game because I'm really interested because I heard it's mostly a new story and some new features and I kinda don't like it if it's just that because it's going to be like if it's going to be like the base game no I will pass maybe if there's a sale <laughs> yeah alright the next game is freestyle 2 this is a basketball game obviously plain and simple I used to play the first game to pass time and I saw someone playing something that looked like freestyle so I was like oh freestyle <laughs> still alive but I don't know if, if it's freestyle that I saw but so I searched it and I saw that the number two freestyle is up so I downloaded it and played it so how did it go of course it's still a decent pastime game to change things up but to be honest, I never felt like anything changed from the once to the first one to so this. Of course, the UI and music changed, so I really felt like it's still the same old good stuff. And yeah, the music is very nice, very catchy, so if you want to check this game out, it's on Steam. Next up is Tree of Savior. So I'm doing the dailies and some stuff to get them silver and then suddenly I kind of decided to look at the Tree of Saber website and I saw that they are planning to do a major overhaul of the game so I was like oh nice and then I read more and I kind of realized that why would they do all this effort and consume this much resources while the game is still runs like crap <laughs> but then again yeah it's really nice because it's something new to play with right but i still feel that they could have focused on the optimization first well anyway we are going to wait for that and hopefully they don't release it and rush it in a broken state coming up next is moon legend so the month of november was the first anniversary of the game and the events are very good and a lot of people are showing up at these events and you can clearly see that the game isn't that dead yet yet yeah <laughs> I said yet because with all of the things that they are adding in this game all the pay to win stuff this game is going to have a hard time getting a recommendation from everyone even though the base gameplay is very good and all the good ideas that they have here are awesome it's still not going to be enough because when upcoming people see how they monetize this game it's going to be awful 
I hope that the publishers see this but I highly doubt it because this is the plan all along <laughs> I'm just gonna enjoy the game without spending anything the fifth game is Ragnarok M so about an hour or more you can do the dailies in this game like the ref the quest ET and all that grindy stuff so yeah the game is getting close to a decent MMO but I still don't like the controls I feel like they could do a lot more eh, but overall the game is decent so if you have an Android phone which is a bit capable try this out because you can get a decent amount of fun here and a lot of people to play with and I mean a lot the last game that I'm going to show you guys is Warframe so I played a decent amount of Warframe and oh god this game is good it's addicting but I kinda reduced my gaming time here cause I wanted to play Destiny and I can tell you right now this game is awesome and if you're looking for a game to spend your time <laughs> I recommend this. It's on Steam. That's it guys. November was a really amazing gaming month. And I'm sure December is going to be the same. Because of all of the events that are going to happen in all the games we play. Anyways. Like if you like the video. And subscribe if you want to help the channel. This is Andre of Gaming Hardcore. See you in the next one.